I was one of those people who doesn't even believe about, about the COVID. It was scary for me because when I wake up, I didn't know that what happened. I was so close, so close to die. Thank you for saving my life. Thank you for taking care of me. And um, and I'm here, you know, this is the simple. I'm, I'm there simple. My daughter just turned two years old uh, two days ago. It's just been such a blessing to make it to this uh, uh, milestone because, um, you know, my that was my primary focus. My goal to get home is to get back to being a father and making sure my daughter had me in her life. The environmental specialist coming in, uh, you know, he was cleaning the room. He would come in every day. But uh, I just remember even him, he would come in. He, uh, before he left the room, he stopped, he looked at me and he just said, hey, I just want you to know that you're going to make it and you're going to be fine. Um, extremely blessed for everything that you've done. And I know my family is and I know my daughter is. And every birthday is going to be thoughts of you guys and uh, what you've done to get me there. It's always hard, you know, when, you're, when your kids are in the hospital, they're sick and you can't make them feel better. Very attentive to his needs when he was there. Um, and into mine as well, you know, I mean, they they wouldn't wake me up if they saw me sleeping and they would just check on him. Thank you so much. You guys are great. I mean, they're always wonderful. It's always better sweet when we go in there. It's kind of like seeing family again. Um, they're, they just take, you know, good care of me and Jace. I would describe it as very, very awesome because they saved me. Um, sorry. <laughs> It always, every time I think about it, it like triggers like all these emotions. Um, I'm very thankful for the care they provided for my, for myself and my son. You're giving us a second chance at life, and I thank you very much for that. When I first woke up, I had no idea what was going on, and I had the intubator in, so I couldn't talk. The nurse, I kind of was pointing to her in my eyes, and she's like, "Is that in your eyes?" I'm like, "Oh God, yes, thank you." I wasn't talking though, so I was like, "Oh, like, you know, not talking." And she grabbed a towel and it would like cover it up. So where just my face was not hit with the lights, you know, and it seems super silly, but I actually got to sleep that night and small things like that. And like, I'll, I'll always remember that. To the healthcare workers, um, regardless of what you're going through now, you guys are, you know, you're angels in the flesh or um, what you did for me and others like me. Can you say hi, Jace? Think about the positive and all the lives you guys, you know, are touching. A little bit goes a long way and just don't give up hope and keep going, you know. You kept my family together. Thank you.